The artist that walk through your studio as not nobody is a different man. That one is a player road. Sure. Terror Dan, I'm at like the place, you know. I'm here the best review. What's up, everybody? It's your girl Dolly XO, and from your city intro, you don't know what's about to take place. So tonight, I am here with none other than the YouTube King slash artist manager slash producer Terror Dan, and of course, from the host of hits, we have the hit producer himself, Noel One Time. Now tonight, we'll be discussing the business of music. Of course, you know well. Go party and we see the artist in my Wuga show, but we're not too really know what go on behind the scenes. So tonight they're gonna be diving in a bit of the business of music and educate us on what really goes on behind the scenes of dance hall. So Teradan, let's start with you. What's up and tell me about this new journey because I'm gonna be honest, I didn't know that you ventured into producing now because you know I'm always see face my YouTube, so let me know. Um, how that's been going and you know what created your love for music and why did you dive into it? Well music I saw me in my life long time so you see. So I've been a review of songs, you see me? Uh -huh. We know we we know the hit songs. So we just figure say yo we just wanna start producing our own music. You see me? So I just the love of my happy from a long time, you see. Okay, so you you had a love for it for from ever since, but yeah. you just start uh, venture in other more in depth part in yeah, it. Yeah, we just venture in the production side. Okay, is there anybody that kind of guidelines you into this or showed you um, what to do, what not to do in the level of producing? Because even though we don't know much about what goes on in producing, we hear that you know it's a um, a crab in a barrel mentality thing. I don't know. So who kind of helps you with that? Well, quite a few producers, including Noel one time. What do more producers? We have to ask the pointers to learn. Because they would have done the game before we So we have to ask questions. How this work? How the business part of work? Because we have to know if we are going to fuck green. You know? you that is it? true. We don't want to just go in and suck and then say, blood to that uh, fuck you know? Yeah. So we want to get it right first, before anything else. Like the business is right from morning, what you're going Is it? That is true. That is it. So, Noel, tell... I mean, you have a notorious reputation on the streets for, you know, giving young artists or young producers um, leeway into the business and, you know, that's unheard of or unusual. So what made you want to, you know, guideline terror into music? Um... We're, we're always like to see you to do the right thing as it and um, it's, it's a good business venture as it relates to um, creativity um, and the entire package that it comes with because um, producing is come from the word production mm -hmm. and once you're talking about production you have all they have more than one element it's not just the end product that audience normally get which is a track or the the, the 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 single song that you see out there it comes with adverti advertising it comes with marketing it comes with sales it comes with all of that so um it gets even you as the individual producer rounded so i would recommend it to any youths who want to try it as i can see a lot of youths right now really music as it is like a, a, a escape from the system mm -hmm. and the system we know we, we know you, you go to high school that that we're bashing against um education, education. yeah it's it's kind of like a a, a, a escape boat for youths who are not um educated to they can even use music to get themselves ed educated in the long run so that's that's why i i always recommend it to other people or other youths for try it because it is something that is fruitful and, and uplifting. So oh, okay. All right. So what I want to ask you now, and don't bother answer because terror upon the coach over there, so is, um, do you, die, do you think him have it? Because, you know, as a senior producer in the business or whatever, I'm just, I'm just like coming in and I know you probably had some studio times with him or whatever. You yeah. think him have it? Because him definitely have the vlogging thing, like, but we don't know what a producer there. Tell me if him yeah. have it. Music is like leadership, you know. You, you, can, you can have the talent and you can also be taught. 
and the most important thing about music is you know when something sounds good from it, you know something good. Mm-hmm. You understand me? And terror, and terror know that. Because you have a lot of producers don't know when a song sounds good from it, you know song good. They just know say I want to sing this. So there is something about music that when you hear a track, you know say yo, this track it's or this hit song. Or miss. It go hit or it go miss. Yeah. There's there's this and, and, and I, I would even say yo that is something that can be taught. It is something that is innate inside of you. Mm-hmm. Where you know say yo from an ear a song. I think that's something that's that, that that's natural gift. In, inside a natural gift inside of every producer. Once you hear a song and you believe in it and you know you see that song, yeah? It's God, God. Right. Understood. So Tara, tell me how you feel about the reopening of the entertainment sector, what that means for you as a producer, right? What that means for you as a producer. And tell me about some of the projects that you've worked on in the past or that you're working on now. Of course, you know, without breaching any type of contract or NDA that you might have had. Uh, well, the reopening of the entertainment sector still. For, for the producers, them can go out to the party and go promote. Mm-hmm. You see me? Me and that type of person still in is it? Me use the internet to promote. So okay. You say your so. CDD is done. <laughs> no, well, you have to do it on the street, but I'm saying it's not in the street. Alright. Me you not really going there still, you see? So, the reopening of the, of the entertainment sector still, and the artists they really like that, you know? Because producers are the first to them, where. I'm glad they touched upon that. I'm glad they touched upon that. Yes, say for the artists them, right? So remember, yeah. remember we say we are trying to educate ourselves on what happens behind the scenes of dance hall. So why is it beneficial to the artists them and not to the producers more so? All right, all right. You see, the entertainment sector normally artists who done book for a show mm-hmm. and everything. Okay. And they want to show up at one party and make them vice versa. Producers not do that. You see me? Mm-hmm. So if me ever do it. I normally promote, then I promote a song with already record, but then I like me have a perform or make my voice be heard. Mm-hmm. Unless more of my song play. Yeah, I advertise and marketing. So, no, how does, how does, how does the, how do you get, how do you get paid when the entertainment industry is booming? That's what I want to know. How does the, how does the money part of it go? Can you get the money of the producer them have money or them not have money? Me want to know. Boy, it's the easy <laughs> now. Me want to know. Oh, we, alright. The road is really an advertising and marketing strategy. And you can, um, I see some producers, it's kind of like, well, the younger producers, like myself, coming to all in us, so you know, say, oh, oh. please. We know all. So, all right. So, the, the younger producers, they, more, they are more using the internet. But then, you, you have to go out there because mm. the dance hall. The, the, the platform, that's where your music will be heard. So you have to go out, you have to get a disc jockey them, your, your CD back in the days, or, yeah, or you have to get them your, 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 your vinyl back in the days, mm-hmm. and get your music to be heard. But now it's more easy because you can just sit down at your house right now as a producer yeah. and promote over the internet. Mm-hmm. You have Instagram, you have Facebook, you have YouTube, you have all of those platforms where you can advertise. But then so... Right now, um, the inter- the entertainment industry being open right now, it's good for producers and artists because guess what? You have the party them same way. And it's good for go out and mingle and get f- and, and stand up in a one party or a club and see what your song do. Because when you stand up and you see say, your song drop and you see how the crowd react, yeah. you tell yourself, alright, then you know say that song is on fire, we, can, we, we need to put in some more um, investment in it as it relates to the radio. As it relates. So, going out in the street, that aspect sure. of it show you what your song is really doing in the streets. Okay. Mm-hmm. So it is, it, is, it is an important part. So I'm going to tell younger producers now that you can't take that away from the music because that is really what show you say, all right, then that's You can't stay home and know what your song is doing. Unless a man send you a clip and say, dog, you know, say, oh, mm-hmm. your, part, your song, you see me? Or a man. Or, <laughs> <laughs> so as me, I say, still tear up. So the inside thing, you have a work. It needed. Yeah. 
No, him say some important, you know, him say him send somebody out, you know, because him, him, him is not that personality, I can't force him. First him, mm-hmm. But then I still the right truth. So. Right truth. So, we do like the Lord nice sometimes. Yes, and that given. So, if you must send somebody out there, the same thing. Because I want somebody, still in it. somebody I represent right. for terror than. Every time. At the same, yeah. same difference. But, I would advise young producers, say, when you can't take out the dance or out of the music. And that's why. Is it the, the 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 black then music them? Mm-hmm. It live on more. Class, live on because because at the dance hall bust it. Yeah. When yeah. the dance hall bust the song in there, live on more than when the internet yeah. bust it. Yeah. 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 The internet is is just a hot topic. Temporary. Cause after a while, mm-hmm. somebody the internet is something when we realize you want more. You always want more. You want yeah, more. You, you want, want more. more. Yeah, you get me? Enough. So after you cannot Understand. get enough of the internet. You cannot, cause somebody right now you can sit down by your phone in this couch mm-hmm. for the entire day and your the internet can amuse you from eight o'clock in the morning go straight back to eight o'clock in the night. You can sit down by your phone and you can find one million things to do by your phone. So the internet is something that you always want more, and that is even another aspect of music where, mm-hmm. where producers need to venture into because guess what, the internet is somewhere vast. There are so many ways of how to promote your music via the internet. Not just Instagram and YouTube. Which so many things. Really all the money, all the money. No, but uh, yes, you just look for Noel. But just uh, you, me, I wait for him all the money <laughs> part. <laughs> <laughs> me, I wait for him to about all the money well, sharing go. Within, well, within the artists and the producers. Yeah, all right. So, you know, we understand, say, when artists book show, you know, them are for people, them, the promoter, them are for pay the artists. Mm. And, you know, that's how the artists pocket theme bread. My question is, how the producer them pocket for them bread? Oh. All right, that's a very, very important yeah, part. Very, very important. <laughs> All right, let me tell you something. God, people me, get it twisted in People it. always yeah. get it twisted as it relates mm-hmm. with producers and artists. Artists get pay several different ways. Artists get pay by performance. Mm-hmm. Artists get paid by dub, dub sessions. Mm-hmm. Artists get paid by them 45s. 45 for people who don't know that is, is, is a track itself. Yeah, the track itself. Mm-hmm. All right, so, so watch this now, artists get paid. An artist that is established, established meaning your boss, layman term, your boss, your boss and your day in the mm-hmm. street. Yeah. A man, I'm going to say, all right, then he's going to start off with, say, a 6,000 US. Yeah. Zin, when him say more six grand, you have to pay him for that six grand as a producer. Yeah. We're not talking in house producers, we're talking producers who see the same boss and want a track from him. So mm-hmm. he might go charge and six see same of a pulling and power. See same of a pulling really power. Say, yeah. For say, all right, then for it invest. Because yeah. it's a business. And we should not forget that this is a business. Music mm-hmm. is a business. Separate and apart from the liquor we drink, the weed we smoke, the, 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 the vibes within the, the studio, um, everybody apart and having a good time, mm-hmm. it is a business. Please try not to forget that it is a business. So when the artist get paid for him song, mm-hmm. the artist also get paid for dubs. So once that song is out, if him have a pulling power, meaning him, him, him song them all. Or if the song that it, him at now, so everybody going to listen to everything when him drop. Mm-hmm. Selectors are going to want dubs. And the dubs, it, 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 it is the artist's decision. So if the artist decides, okay, I need $400 for a dub or I need $600 to to, a thousand US. That's what I want for a dub. Mm-hmm. So it is the artist's decision to make that money. But you don't must get it. So but you don't must choose. get it. You understand you say, me? So yeah. you have to say, all right, you can, you can say you want $1,000, which is a thousand US for a dub. Mm-hmm. And nobody not take the dub from you. Mm-hmm. But you're hot. And they have a one man. But people don't want to pay it. A one man. You can do five dub for $200. And you can do five dub for $200. Mm-hmm. So you choose. So you choose. So what you want to do? They, they, that's where artists make their money. By um, them 45 dubs and also performance. Alright, so for, the, for the week, you can have up to 10 shows for the week. If you're at you are a real at, at artist. Mm-hmm. So you mentioned, really? you mentioned about the entertainment industry. The entertainment industry open up now. Mm-hmm. I really the artist now. I go really make food up. I can one track. Um, say 15 party for the week. Mm-hmm. An artist can just produce that one hit song. And each of those parties, in the one is, song. they in 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 in, in Jamaican dollars. Them cannot charge them like eight hundred eight hundred US eight hundred thousand um dollars or six hundred thousand dollars for one performance. So times six hundred thousand by fifteen. Only for money that. 
So the artists them not bluff. The artists them have money for true. So that's why you understand. So the producers make money. No. no but, but, but listen to me now. Listen to me now. Listen to me now. Listen to me. But that's how we had Pan Noel. But that's how we had. No, but that's how we left the producers. Every producer has some bro. No. But say. That's why. That's why we leave the producers. No. For last. Because guess what? Why leave it for last? People. Listen. One. Same like the artists. The producer have an image to maintain. Because they can't walk in and party in your slippers. Our shots going to party true, true. as Noel one time. Yeah, so well, uh, or stay at Chop City. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. So both yeah. parties have an image to maintain. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So therefore, what that say? The oh we make money, I'm gonna go reach right this because no, it is yeah, no, no because I'm gonna say wait for this. Watch this now. Oh, producers make money. Mm-hmm. Producers, make money. Mm-hmm. producers make money on the platforms that they release the songs. That's copyrighted. Alright, watch this now. When the, we are going to start from the inception before it becomes even a truck. Artists come into the studio, the artist's voice, the, meaning the artist don't have to write him lyrics. Mm-hmm. Pr- it, sometimes it is the producer's job to, to write, get somebody a writer. Because sometimes the artist, you, you, you hear the, the artist, but him don't have the lyrics for that song. Yeah. So one, you have to pay a writer for write the song. Yeah. Then mm-hmm. for make him deliver it in the boat. Writer's prices are. I think are, they can negotiate. Yeah, can yeah. Writer's price prices varies. Like it depends on what they charge. Some writers them ask you, "Who are the artists?" Yeah, mm-hmm. cause it depends on who the artist do. You understand me? So, right so, so, so can I even give you a definite price for say art dinner at twenty thousand Jamaican dollars? Um, a writer would a charge or a fifty thousand Jamaican dollars. The price varies. So that's the starting of everything to get the, the right. So. Rhythm, I have some producers, they don't make rhythm. True. So they have to buy that rhythm from someone who made the rhythm. You, 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 you're going to start telling you, oh, we'll make money yet. Yeah, <laughs> we're going to start telling the process. Really 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 no, but that's, what, that's why we're here. No, 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 that's why we're here because, you know, what does ear no. saga want to know what going to be behind the song? I'm going to show you, say, I spend it. <laughs> but I really tell you how we make money. But, we may start all right, you talk about you talk about who not spend first. All right, yeah. all right. <laughs> so we start yeah, out with the spending yeah. before. All right. Oh, me I go show you how we make back money from all of our spending. So what? Remember, you know, me say to you say, oh, you have producers who make rhythm. People like Andrew Black say, have Son of Vic. But can list out at several different we'll producers who make rhythm, mm-hmm. and they are also producers. But majority of the, the players in the game, they don't make rhythms. True. They buy rhythms. So, you have to buy a rhythm. So, no, you, want, you buy a rhythm or you make rhythm? You buy a rhythm. Alright. You understand me? I will make rhythm as well. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's said me worse. <laughs> well, 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 in, in my case still. Me sit down with my engineer them still and make rhythm. Because sometimes you want a sound. Mm-hmm. It, and it better you sit with them and you say, no mm-hmm. man, put in some more ayat or put in some more drums. Put in some more snare right there. So, no man, drop the bass right there. So, drop two more kick right there. So, so. Mm-hmm. that in is, that in is a form of making rhythm. Our, our team, I don't really buy rhythm, you see me? Them just, the team is just a part of the production. Yeah. You dig me? I say, so, yeah, there are man where, 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 where they're not the team, we can build with him. You yeah. see me? So, it, it costs less from that side there. So, so, so if you can... like you have your own studio, and you so don't If you can work. cut costs, like what Terry has said, <laughs> you, cut it, uh, you cut it as you go along. But, yeah. but, but that's why, but that's why I don't want to draw it Yeah, draw this so no, long, long reasoning. Yeah. Watch this now. Remember, you know? Artists, no, they know right they say yet, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And the money be your money. I've spent. Money I spent already, you know, for right. So when you still say no get bops and get the rhythm, artists voice on the rhythm. Because sometimes I have to send out. Some artists different. Some artists can voice on spot. Some artists can voice. You have, they have to listen to the rhythm, meds it, and then it comes to the come Fine, back. Right, watch this now. And I got, I got talk. The reason why I don't want, I never want to explain the... the the, 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 the production part, meaning if you have like a, a bridge in a rear, mm-hmm. watch me talk like a man who don't have no links, studio time. Mm-hmm. It's the producer's responsibility. So if the artist take 12 hours to voice that song, that's the, the average studio time is 4000 an hour. $4,000, 4000 Jamaican dollars an hour. Mm-hmm. So if the artist spend 8 hours in the studio, it's $4,000 times 8. Eight fours hour. 
Then you didn't know? <laughs> you didn't watch that. Why am I embarrassing Bambi with YouTube? Why am I? What is that shoot? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? It boils down back to say the music business escape most of you. Isn't it? Because you even ask about four times and all them something. Mm -hmm. I can't tell. Me, I feel my phone. <laughs> yeah, no, but sure. I forgot my phone. phone and type in that. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, but what I say is this. Yeah. What I say is this. We pay for that student time there. Mm -hmm. And remember, you know, you yourself, the producer, where you yeah, yeah, show this money. I don't even know where this song is going to go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right? So the song voice. You spend eight hours on the studio. The song voice. You pay a writer already. You pay the reading man already. And you pay for your student time. Now you have a track in your hand. Mm -hmm. Zin, what's the next step? The next step is for you to say, all right, then you're going to give this to a videographer. And for the man them where not like me in the game, we didn't have the game a good while. Where we have we equipments them like cameras and all of that. We have a production team. We, we, well, we, we, that be yourself, I say. You're not yeah, oh, you don't have anything. That no, that never say. Yeah. Me like me where we have we, we think them already. It's different. It's different for us because while they're going along the game, they cut costs. I am speaking for persons who just started the produ um, um, producing. They now have to send it to a Shane Creative or a Logic. A Logic, so my boy name, but 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 KD. KD and some RD. other man, RD Studios, you have Extreme Arts, all of them, but um, one time films, all of them, that's how we still. You know, we can't live for ourselves. But anyway, okay. you have them have to send that track to one of, one of those videographers. Mm hmm. To get something what you call a treatment for the song. A treatment is a concept for the video. So if the artist has sing, say, oh, um, girls what? and rich life. Rich life and girls. Um, and girls. One. Cool, like. Alright, so, look, work with girl. Girl. Oh, Alright, <laughs> say, my sing, bo, big body girl and be a girl in I'm all sunny. Sometimes you wish them to sing them Sunday. <laughs> Yeah. Yo, sometimes sometimes no, the artists have advice though, no, let me show you. Sometimes the artists have advice, no, you no, wish them to say, yo, be a girl in a like when the artists have advice too much, chopping song to me. No. Can't guess what? As it chopping song, Jesus. Can't guess what? Chop when an artist say in him song, say, yo, I have 25 girls right beside me. You have to find all of them. You have to find all of them. You have to find the 20. <laughs> <laughs> You have, have to so find man. the 25 girl him for bring across what mm -hmm. the art to make what he's saying come to life so that the audience sees that. So for one girl, when you show short Cassie, my sister, I say Cassie you no know, say more oh, 25 girl, each girl I charge ten thousand dollars. You have to find artist um attire, which is his clothes that he's going to wear. Mm -hmm. You have to find location. The house or the Airbnb we go use. Some Airbnb they don't want. You know, so them, 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 them give up already. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but that's why they understand. No, they don't get discouraged. They, they, don't, they don't get discouraged. Don't get discouraged man. And that's... they see mother just say I'm going to lead up to when them cash out for them big money. No, and that man, hold on, man, hold on, man. man. That's why I'm going to go through the, the process of the it. Process. Mm -hmm. So, the man understand the spending what producers do. Mm -hmm. Or the investment rather. I would consider spending as something where you don't spend mm -hmm. without no return or no expectation no return, of getting it back. back. Yeah. yeah. So the investment. Mm -hmm. Blind investment. Let me put it at that. <laughs> Blind investment. Yeah, investment mixed with gamble. Yeah, gamble because you don't know. You mm -hmm. can do all of that. But when you reach right there, say it. So when you pay for these girls, pay for the house, pay for the muscat or the artist, a sing boat or the do say, same sing boat do say, I said, Jesus. So sometimes I'm a voice on the studio, I said, no, say, 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 say, no, say, no, say, say, no, say, no, say, no, say, 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 no, say, no, say, no, say, no, say, no, say, or extreme art say oh, four hundred thousand dollars for just do the shoot, whole video. Shoot the video. Show the video and edit it. Like I shoot the video and edit alone. You understand what I said? Yeah. So and that, then that yeah, don't have nothing to do with the props. The props which is and the, the girls, girls and everybody. The liquor, yeah. the Airbnb, 
that's a different cost from what the, the, the videographers are charging, mm -hmm. which is a 300,000. Mm -hmm. So you can run, remember I said, so remember, 300,000 starting price, it can run with the props go straight up to million up. One million dollar up. Depends on what you want to bring across. If you yeah. want a real crisp, clean video, mm -hmm. when people are saying, oh, that video, just, clean. you do the whole of that, if just people say, oh, that video, yeah, your body, body clean. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you do. All That's of that. Exactly. All of that. You spend one million dollars for a couple of people in the comments say, yo, that video is bad. That oh, video is scream like it. You scream like it. Mm -hmm. Big up yourself, BJ. Big up yourself. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Anyway. BJ, you spend for your Yeah, you spend for your views. And I'm going to produce that YouTube comments, you know. <laughs> and the best video this never see a drop. The best video this never see a drop. But them video is a drop. But anyway. Mm. After you spend up all of them money there. Alright, so I'm not kidding. Because not all producers will go up to that margin. Mm -hmm. Say you spend, say, for the entire thing you spend about 200,000. For do everything. For argument's sake. Remember, you know, you don't pay for one right song. You don't pay for studio time. Mm -hmm. So when you stay so now, Bob's and, 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 and get that um, video from the, the, the video director. Mm -hmm. And the video, you look upon it and you say, Alright, then yeah man, this the next step is what? You're going to look at the type of song as a producer. Mm -hmm. You're going to look at when it, it, it is the right time to drop. Because for instance, most of the artists in the industry are singing about pain, sorrow. Like it's a, a say for instance, you use to corona time. Way I go, it's a lot though. <laughs> The big body girl. Yeah. <laughs> the place is locked down. Yes. <laughs> Nobody can go out. Nobody can. <laughs> so timing is a very important part of it. So all of those things is not just to drop songs. Mm -hmm. It's not. So you look at the timing and say, all right, then I'm going to work with summer. Hopefully the place home. Because I'm work with, I'm be realistic as possible. Hopefully summer and the place home. Like how this place home, you know, mm -hmm. good timing for drop a song like that. All right. So you say, all right, then you say, June, I'm drop this song. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They spend up so much money. Yeah, 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 yeah. The next step, some producers don't do it. But this is, this is educational to producers. You link a distributor, get in the songs, the audio, and playlist. Playlist is. Two weeks before. From two weeks before. So the songs, you'll be on YouTube. Pitch. You pitch. You pitch so. Alright, remember now. Remember now. Well, no. Yeah, educate the young producers to come or whatever. Mm -hmm. Suppose them not understand the concept of distributors or whatever. Like, so you need to explain that to them. Like, who are you? Yeah, so the who distributors, are distributors are the persons who distribute your song on the platforms, the various platforms. Okay. Say your Spotify, Apple your Music, Apple Tidal. Music, your Tidal, YouTube, your, um, YouTube all of those. Mm -hmm. your, your distributor do that for you and also pitch your songs for you. Yeah. You understand me? And market it and advertise your songs for you. That's, that's the distributor's role. In, 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 okay. in, 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 in they get a percentage. First they get a percentage for doing that. Yeah. Okay. So me? you have to pay them again? No, or? no. They, they normally take it from the master. Okay. As they, as, as they go along. Okay. I, and I will explain further what the master is. All right. Anyway. So after that, you, you choose a date. The song must drop tomorrow morning. You say, all right then. Remember, you know, you the producer spend so much money out. Oops, say, this song is hot. Mm -hmm. And do well. And do well. Alright then, you drop the song, say the song is a booming song. Hot yeah. song around. Yeah. You yeah. know see me trending new. That trending number one gone. Everybody says I'm bad DJ. Mm -hmm. All the artists end up bust. If it's a young artist and him, nobody never know him. Bust. Mm -hmm. Song hot. Song with six million views in a in space. In a space of like four weeks. Four weeks. Six yeah. million views. Yeah, four weeks. So it is okay. six times eight hundred. Okay. Yeah. That's the rate. Yes, yeah, terrible the calculator, so, no, no, not like so, 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 far. so even if it, so even if it, it reaches, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. it? Yeah, look here now, can you must feel like saying I got to tell the people about the money? So Terrell, go up on the phone, go oh. calculate it. <laughs> so I forgot you. Yeah, about four thousand eight hundred. So all I'll right, and then on the times that by the whatever um currency rate is happening right now. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it depends. You really have to know that it needs to get to the Yeah, no, for the people that want to know. Sure easy, you know? It depends. But anyway, it, it depends. depends. And that, all right. So, and where the views come from. Right. As, a, as, a, as a, a major player of the game, uh, songs that go over 2 million views, 
that shows on YouTube. Cause and the next thing, please, artists, stop focusing on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> please, oh, 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 I'm producer too. The producer stop them too. Stop on YouTube. Stop focusing on YouTube because YouTube is actually the lowest paying um, platform in music. Facts. Yeah. It's the lowest. Facts. So I don't know, I don't know where it come from. You pay a statement. <laughs> That's the what it is. I, I don't know where it come from. Where everybody is just I watching this YouTube, YouTube have, thing. One time YouTube have the most views, but when you look on the platform, they have a little bit of views, yeah. but it appear more than what YouTube more than what YouTube, YouTube is paying. Mm-hmm. And, and fuck. maybe another interview will go down at um or or each platform pays. Mm-hmm. But, but YouTube rate, if you're going through a distributor, I'm not talking about like YouTubers. YouTubers rates are different. Mm. The, 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 if you're going as a, as a producer, you, you go through an algorithm where even the views, they are, they, are, um, them, they are not, they have to be authentic. So even if a man say buy views, is the real views they are get paid for. PFR, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so for instance, you get me? You have 200,000 views real mm-hmm. on your song. And you and buy 800 more. You're not getting paid for that, you know? You're not getting paid for it. Just the 200,000. You're just, you know? you yeah. not, not just, it's just, it's just to appeal, say, yo, I just clap them views. It's not good, but... But it shows, players, I, I, producer like me, I, I can know when an artist is buying views because if you're clocking, say, 6 million views in 3 weeks and I look at your Spotify, I'm looking at your Tidal, I'm looking at your other things and... Yeah, yeah, clock on. With the same song. With the same song. 2,000 views. Mm-hmm. 2,000 views, 3,000 views. Something wrong, guys. Nigga, something. stop buying views. Just <laughs> 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 no, stop it, please. Because. Mm-hmm. A million yeah, views with 200 likes. With 200 <laughs> likes. <laughs> Nigga, Who does that? Just, just stop it. The comments are beer spam. You understand me? So. Beer Indian people. So. As uh, chick two, two. so <laughs> when you look at that and. Yeah, all of that your your work. Oh, what what you look at it? Um, I was about four thousand eight hundred. Four thousand eight hundred US. Mm-hmm. I have convert that. You have a times that by one. Whatever the dollar is. Yeah. yeah one fifty four. That's about one fifty four. Can we go down and the nitty gritty? Yeah. Four thousand eight hundred. Four thousand eight hundred. That is yeah. just we just have a rough check of mm-hmm. what what. That, that's seven hundred and thirty nine thousand two hundred dollars you mm-hmm. make. For after after the first three months, that's what you're going to get. Yeah, for the for the for the winning. And that's just from YouTube alone. That's from YouTube alone. Mm. Yeah. See? So this is four seven seven hundred and thirty nine thousand two hundred. You know the other platforms, sorry, the other platforms maybe run it up to you probably get uh say eight hundred thousand to say nine hundred thousand. Mm-hmm. Cool? Yeah. All right, so you have like, so what, like a after one point? three after the first three months of the song being released, mm. and three months is the general <coughs> yeah, um, time yeah, period. Any, yeah, any yeah, song for the first paycheck, the first paycheck that you're going to get for but the after song. that, every month. So, after that, you're going to get this get a check from that track every month. Yeah. Okay, watch me now. So, you get say 900 toes you get from for, for that for that song. Mm-hmm. Your next paycheck from the song. If it's a booming song like that, remember we calculated it as a booming song, you know, which is a six million views. Mm-hmm. Zin, your next paycheck, you're gonna look on probably maybe the same amount, or you might get a little bit less, like probably depends on how the song is streamed. Cause for that three months that people can just watch a song, then after the three months, people stop watching it. And that's just all the internet is. So you might get near to where you get or a little less than where you get. Yeah, like mm-hmm. it could have, it start out good. It start out good. And then after and it does a while drop. it does so, so your next check you probably get like five hundred thousand. And your money does a good one. The next check you get three hundred thousand. But previous, you can go down, go down in a body, you can just pick up back one of them times. Pick up back you just say, what does, is this? Mm-hmm. And you can go straight down and to yourself. Straight, straight down to yourself, what is? So I say go. And that goes directly in in a your pocket. Yes. The producer's pocket. All right. All right, now. So, that is how a producer get paid. From his tracks, that is. So, you have to put in the work, which is... And that's just one track. That's how a producer get paid. And that's... Okay, and that's the and don't get paid from that, too, right? Well, I, well I, I knew how it go, but, like, I'm sure the general public probably feel like, say, when music, most are in artists' station. Well, I don't know. I, before... 
getting educated, and I, I figure that when artists get book producer get a percentage, and everybody get a percentage, and them share up. No, that's, that's if, how. That's if the producer is also the artist manager. Okay. okay. So the same person, for instance, one time music is um um where where where, where we we sign um taco warfare. Mm -hmm. For argument's sake, he's booked for a show. We get a percentage from that because he's a artist that is signed. We're we we're, we're doing all managerial aspect of his career. Mm -hmm. So that's a different thing than if you are just a producer for the artist. If you are just a producer and you're not his manager, you don't get a percentage from his performance. It goes directly. Because Check you, the manager, also have to look for, for gigs, like gigs meaning shows, all of that for them. Mm -hmm. And bookings and all of that. So that's how you get the percentage in that. So that's just the master. What I just calculated earlier is the master of the song. So the artist me? get none of that? Artist, what, the master? Yeah. No. You have some... Or it depends. Yeah, it depends. That's what, that's what I get into right now. Some artists, them say, all right, then they want 20% of the master. If it's an artist that is established and them know say them are clock numbers, but them say, yo, I'm going to want 20% of the song. If it is an arrangement between the producer and the artist, if the artist say me say me and me is an artist and, and Terry are the producer and Terry mm -hmm. said to me and Terry are bridging. Mm -hmm. I'm just guitar a song. Don't pay me for the song. I'm gonna say Terry, just give me twenty percent of the master. I take eighty. Mm -hmm. So that figure that I calculated earlier would be that twenty percent of from that the artist will get that. So some artists do that. Based on the, 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 the relationship and based on the agreement. Mm -hmm. So with all of this being said and done, I don't know, I, I just got the overall conclusion that the producers are the real risk takers in the business. You get me? I say, yeah. Not to say that, you know, we're not undermining the artist and talent and that they're not taking a risk or whatever because, I mean, to do the artist thing full time, it's a, it's a risk as well. But with all that being yes, said yeah. and done, yeah, the expense and you know the the, the network that goes into well, the producing yeah, well, and I would think that artists or should I remember have I know. remember I know I'm mean, just remember something you now you get that set out yeah tell where writers are where I tell people say yo you get seven hundred thousand you get nine hundred thousand for the next month you get rare. remember you have other songs for for um for, for doing you know? You have other video for doing it. <laughs> yeah, so you producer, know you take you know, it and you know you have to reinvent it and so so that money that you get from a song that's booming, you can do five more songs after that and none of them no boom. And they still spend half money. And the money you still have to spend and do the videos all that woman explained mm -hmm. earlier. So you can do after that song, which, which as a producer you get a hit song. You come like the chick the chick card game. You get me? You win. You right? Win so? And then for f your five next track as a producer, you're not going to hit song, but you have to spend and make the video. Yeah, so you, think, you don't think you guys are in a constant never ending loop of the studio and working? Why you stop? Why you stop? You don't stop. You don't start, so you don't stop. The world knows so you have a third Chop City record. Uh, anyhow, you get a hit song uh, out, of the, out, of the, out of the production and you stop them and say you fall off. You fall off. You have to continue so and keep up your game. You have to juggle this thing. You can't car. look shabby neither. You can't look shabby in the streets. You have to mm -hmm. have your puma. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> I want to know. You have to maintain the image. Going back to the inception of, um, you know, you get the ghost writer and, you know, get a studio time. When an artist you know, I'm unknown, I'm not established or whatever. What, as a producer, what am I going to decide to art? You know what, I want to take on glad the it, artist. I'm glad yeah. you like. you punch a point there. Yeah. Watch this now. That is why you have most producers right now, they are moving from voicing younger mm. artists. Mm -hmm. that's, why, that's why you have to rate man like Terry Dan. You have to rate man, man, man like we. Well, you have to rate man like our shop that. You have to rate the art, the producers, them we all give them a chance. I give a little you them me. a chance because mm -hmm. watch us now. When we drop a juggle, if you check all of our juggle, we we'll add at least two to three young artists on it. So if you have a, 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 a juggle, our juggles we, 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 very exclusive. You have like a Movada, a Sean Paul, mm -hmm. top of the food chain. We we'll give our artists a strength. So with with the juggle. With that pull force that those major artists are of, yeah, to bring attention give to that. those young artists at least two to three from time to time. That's why, as producers, they offer the juggle. 
you have to do the job because guess what? That is what you use and pull your little young artist and say, Alright then, go on a road you. Step and big with him. You understand me? Yeah. So imagine yeah. you hear a mother playing a party and as a young artist, you hear your song drop after that because it's a go play because it's a juggle. You understand what I say? Yeah. So you have to rate and respect the producers that do that. You have some producers. We work with young artists. They don't do it none at all. Unknown as they mentioned. You get me? I said yeah. they don't do it none at all. Yeah. So you have to. No, but then it. again, you, you know, it's easier not to work with young artists. Mm-hmm. It's easier, you know. Yeah, no, because for it's true. It's fuck up. It's so fuck up, no? It's easier because. Remember, it's a business, you know? Mm-hmm. It is a business. So if you say, say, all right, the artist they establish, we just deal with the money business. Give my money, take us out, get back my money. But with a young artist, it's with a investment. young artist, yeah, no. Yeah. Yeah. It's kind of different from when you just see a big artist and mm-hmm. make a song. Mm-hmm. And just close the business right there. But then I think it go back to where you said earlier, it boils down to the love of music because the one them where we just take money Let and get and give song. Let me tell you why they, them, them not really it is a job. love. Although, I never said this, I don't care if artists can because I don't respond. Mm-hmm. It, 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 it is a joy for me, even when the artists them get them bus and them, them change. Because every artist, the artist that walk through your studio as a nobody is a different man than when he sang a player road. True. So when that artist walk through the door, me know say him, him old attitude, me know say him old um, or daily things going to change because I'm experiencing at the game. Me know that. And I know at what point it's going to change. When a man realizes say, him can't get any girl anymore, if he go to the gas station, people are saying, Jesus Christ! Oh, oh my God! That, mm-hmm. that, that does something to your, 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 brain. your, your brain. If you are somebody who don't know how to control power. You understand what I say? It does something to you. So I know, as a senior man in the game, say, yo, watch you know? At that point, they are going to change. So me, myself, have to know how to deal with them as a producer. You understand what I say? So, when that happened, a man and nobody walk into the studio. And you give him that strength. Mm-hmm. Then what? Happened? You for tell him what happened. <laughs> tell, the people happened? Them, tell the people them what happened. Remember, you know, nobody walk into the studio, you get it song and them, them change after a while. Mm-hmm. Change. Sometimes I'm changing for the good and sometimes I'm changing for the good. And you yourself sit down yeah. and say, are the, are the same man this? Yeah, well you get a strength. I see. <laughs> are the same man this? We say yo, beg you, I, 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 I read him the um, bad producer, I give him the rhythm and him boss. Y'all are call him phone, you can't get him. Y'all are say come voice, you can't get him. I see my voice with some other man. You see my voice with some other man. You, 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 you can't get him for vice. You, you have a show, but you are you boss him, you know? You have a show, you want him going to say, watch you know? You're not too deep on them show, they still, you know? Hey, for us, take it. Yeah, for us, take it. You understand what I mean, I say? It's, but, them things that demotivate you, demotivate you. From working with young From working with young It's just natural, we are human beings. You understand me? But at the end of the day, it's the love of music and... Them, them for glad someone like we there at the game. That's a true. Cause I love, love it while we still do it. It, it. it is stressful, especially the man of, of 9 to 5, like mm-hmm. myself, and I do music. People ask me how I do it. Mm-hmm. Every day they ask me how I do it. True. Rough, man. Rough, man. Cause because man, music you know, is a 9, 9 to 5. 5. <laughs> 9 to 5. Mm-hmm. Music is at 12. <laughs> so, and a midnight, I say, you know. I'm glad they go right there so because that, that they're bring me in a you know my next question to you know debunk some myths that we have or you know fact or you know mm-hmm. myth with the recording industry or whatever. Um, why is it that it's between the hours of 12 to 5 where the producers call it golden hour, I believe. But me tell you, me can't advise no artist in a day. Me, me, I, and, and, and it's not even somewhere ma 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 see people are doing, I do I'm just do it. It's it's just they see them hours yeah, like night. Mm-hmm. And them ten and the trees that move. Just sleep. 
it, it, so it, it does better. It does better. Better, man. It, yeah, I, better. I don't man. know what. I don't. I don't know. But I just feel like. I feel like it's just a only thing because no one can explain it. It's just like it's better. I don't know what is it, but you know why? You know why? Like pretty now. When the party them get nice. In a midnight Mid- ago, yeah. one o'clock, yeah. two o'clock. Like them all so we have to make the song them time, the two car. Yeah. We have to meds or that. Yeah, in sync. Gear about that. Gear about that vibe. Them time at the party I get nice. Yo, play my bad song. So you have to try to get a bad song to play them time, the two. Yeah, see me? So that's why most time. The night, the night vibe does give a more better vibe. You see, it does more relax. Yeah, vibe. Man. No, but I can't drive past. Remember the day done in a, and Just during the day. Nice and cool, during you know? the day, most producers are hard to sleep during the day. Mm-hmm. Our sleeping hours that because we bleach all night at studio mm-hmm. and we get up say two three o'clock, ready for the road again. Um, you know, earlier Noel mentioned that you know he's worked with some very established artists, you know, the likes of Sean Paul and Movado, you know, we have Dexter, whatever. But is is there anyone or anyone on your list or agenda, Tero, that you say, boy, you know, if I get a song from this person, it's it for me. And I mean, if you want to name drop, yeah, so fine. For me, what do you mean? Like, like- like you just say, all right, no. As a producer, that. as you a pro- <laughs> <laughs> no, I want to say retire, but as a producer, yeah. for say, so all right, real, yeah. Which artist you don't want to get a, a a record from? No one offend nobody. You know what I mean? Yeah, but you like, know. You can't just. You must say all the parties more work with them. All the part top parties more than love for work with. So. Me don't want to call one name and then. And then everybody feel bad. Me don't work with the artist. Then I call him name. <laughs> you know what I say? Yeah, so, the politics are. Yeah, you know them things. Okay. So. And then we go call a name them. now and then. And next artist. And next artist feel away about it and about want to work with you. Isn't it? So, me. And then we work with them. Isn't <laughs> it? So, but know. you definitely have your eyes you set for. What do you mean? Please. But explain a little bit for the masters, masters with the artists and the splits them and where the artists get and read. Oh, like. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Say so, that me that I think them would I want for no. Yeah, because yeah. you have something that you call the publishing. That's that that deals with the the, 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 the songwriter, as I said earlier, and that deal with if the song is being played on the radio, if the song is being performed, though that's the publishing aspect of it. So that's where the artist get a percentage from the track. Mm-hmm. So the artist have to get a percentage, right? So, right? Uh, as in, in in the publishing? Yeah. If the artist writes a song. What if him don't write the song? If you don't write the song, you might get publishing for, for, for something so, you write. So, where the artist are going to get then, if you don't get the publishing, if you don't write the song? Hmm? Where you going to get? Like, oh, if you write the song, he sing the song, you know? Mm-hmm. But somebody write the lyrics for him. Yeah. Where him get then? He not get no write the song. He might get performance. <laughs> that, that's him going to get. But if the man don't write, so, write, so write. the money, the money to check the way I come in. No, that... Him, him, Listen, listen to me, man. Unless him get the percentage, yeah, that, that's what you're saying. Unless him get listen a to me, man. Twenty percent. Listen to me, man. All right. Listen to me. Don't listen to no one. Listen to me. Listen. Remember, me don't tell us the artists get paid for the what artists are business and producer business. Um, but producer is supposed to get paid. Artists are supposed to worry about about percentage. With with master and 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 what producer get away. You get remember, you know. Is that common though? In in the industry for producers and artists to tussle over. Not with me. Yeah, it's common. Well, that's why it is a risk. For work with somebody where I really don't have an idea. Yeah, alright. No, because, alright. So, it's a for, Okay, because the corona I period. Wait now. So we'll get a hit song. Mm-hmm. They're not like a KDK, Shani, is it? They're not even, like a rap, them. Not even yeah, that. I'm glad, I'm glad that you brought it up, Tara, because we're, we're just, you know, slowly moving out of the pandemic now. And, and like I said, you know, the entertainment industry wasn't booming. So, of course, the artists never get booked for show as much because yeah, we well, all had to be it. we all had to be inside them. They have to do dubs or whatever. But say, for example, they release a hit song during Corona period. Mm. No, you, we already discussed that they get majority of their um, money from performances, from shows or whatever. Right? No, we just come out of the pandemic. You know, mm-hmm. no events not keep. They can't do any shows or whatever. Mm-hmm. What was that like for you guys as producers? Because of course, you know, we're just to talk about the splitting of the masses or whatever. Like, what was the what was that like for you as producers? Because really the artist get him, the artist get him in big song and it had do good on all of the streaming yeah. platforms. We so can you can? We're on food. 
No, you're laughing. Wait till Andrew said this place, um. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I really thought, yeah. you, you sit, turn, man. you sit, and you wait because when the wait place the open, when them are make for them food, you know, we can't go. No, say we put so the artists them were released them song in a lockdown. Remember now, remember this good, and we lock down the place. I know we locked down the place. Mm -hmm. It is just, never, it, it is place just. Never locked down before. Let me tell you, you know why, you know why artists are interfering right now with producer about percentage and ray and t and t and t. Mm -hmm. Because the place did lock down. Right now, I can tell you, no artist not giving the producer about the percentage from the master. Because the place open right now. And at the artists them time now for make money. So, I can tell you this right now. You're not, but alright. The producers them, we sure. the. Collect the money that I'm on time. That money there is going down. Yeah. The song, nobody can really uh, stream it hard again. Yeah, because yeah. they can't go to the show. Remember see them. Yeah, can't go to the show now for see the artists them right now. The song is a streaming thing. You know? So if I get six million in a in a last three month, that six million in a day, that six million that six million views eh, now nah go add on again so mm -hmm. easy you know. No, I don't because, because six million got, people see it already. Probably good to get the six million and it don't Yeah, for good to get another six million the summer for act like yeah, a. Yeah, for good to get the next million. Alright. Yeah, for alright. Well, look at the some song, you see some song go six million in three weeks. And that did so tell all uh, ten years. This is six point three million views. Okay, that moves slow, everything does slow down. So that money they slow down. You see me about the artist, money not really slowed down so easy. He can't slow down so easy because guess what? He's performing that song across the world. The world wants to hear that song. And we are talking about local answer. money. We are talking about local money. When him go places like England, we might get paid a pound for perform that song. Mm -hmm. When him go places like Canada, America. we might get Canadian dollars. We go America, we might go all different states that perform that song. If it's just that song that people want to hear. Why are you arguing with a producer over a percentage of... What the producer getting... still there, yeah, that try to get other song to try to Why get though? money again. And... It, it's right. a business man, you know? Listen to me, I just, I just think artists need to learn the, the business. business of music. Not the music of music. Not the music of music, <laughs> but the business the aspect business. Mm -hmm. of music. Because you can, you can know when an artist knows the business of music. Artists like Alkaline and other, various other artists, you can, you can see how or oh, their 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 career is structured, and uh, you can Movado. cartel Movado, um, Sean Paul, mm -hmm. even if they are are managed by a, a label, mm -hmm. you can see where they where where you can see the difference with artists who are not managed and artists. Okay. Well, I more said yeah. this very important point. On the stop run from management. Stop run from management. Managers can rob you if you know the business of music. And if a, if a man gives a contract for say my manager career, take it, pay you a lawyer, make them go through the contract with you and advise you. Further. Further. But you cannot lose if you have management. Management structure your career. Because you see the dog money them where you get you put in your right pocket. <laughs> I peel out 10 grand, I buy some weed, I peel out another 10 grand and buy some liquor. All of them things there. Add up. Add up. Mm -hmm. But when you have a manager and the manager collect, say, you 10 dub them where you get, and your manager put aside entertainment, which is your weed money, your liquor money, your this money, and you know, say, when that pop it pop, mm -hmm. and your time, come entertainment money done. Mm -hmm. Your, your, your career now is more structured where you can feed your family where when downtime they when you now find a hit song really the money when you now find a hit you can find a one hit, one hit song you know you run the place you get beard up you know and then you cannot find another hit song but I will see that many times many times it happen a man find one song and he just can't find another song now hear him sing him sing from now till the morning <laughs> He cannot find that song, so stop running away from management. I never understand the artist now go at forever. You, you now go at forever. So when you Just yourself, like you can't stay young forever. You when so the attitude the way you give people and go on like an iPad and this an iPad and that. Remember, I say yo, sense. there's going to be a time when you can't find it. And all the people them wear iPad, all of the people them wear the door them wear lock, the bridge them wear burn. Just think about that. 
But is that is that um, factual though? I mean, in some sense it is. Say I'm not act forever. What, but what would you say about the legends that has graced dancehall? We're still at Tell now. Tell me one legend. Well, at now, like at, at, at forever, right through. When, when, I, when I deal with um, when, when, when tell me one, not even that. Tell me one legend in this music industry where at and they've never been managed by anybody before. Tell me. Tell me um, who got no, through this industry as a legend. Well, well I, I don't know about, I don't know well, about well, the management who part. this industry as a legend when I get managed? No, not like the, 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 the it's like common knowledge for no one said the artist when I get managed, they've never gone away too and far for too long. And even if there is one, even if there is one or two or three, me can tell if them the right is right now, them can say them would have changed that in their life, in their career. Forget, a, forget a manager. If they could. If they could. Understood. Because a lot of people, a lot of artists shy away from it. But guess what? It's structure. If words, if you have a manager, we, we mean you're good. What? I know. All right. I know I'm a young talent. Read really, right. That's why. All right. Most of the people we think say, yo, Jano started a youth a bad and nobody know how to work with him. And Jano started a youth and have a talent that yo, gave him the break and rare, rare, rare. Why most producers don't work with them type of artists that were young and them not have, it's just a big, big gambler thing. Mm -hmm. A talent alone about people, you know. Mm -hmm. You see me? You with a talent, you know, without the proper links, the proper guidance. Have, it, and, and, the, and, the, and, the, and the and the and the and the strings them we have to pull. Let me tell you this. Mm -hmm. Me have a virgin from my school days. Mm -hmm. Wicked. The wickedest thing you can find. Well talented. And them them just did it. <laughs> so, so if you know, um, if you know still some books now, and say that you have bad and you work with him, mm -hmm. and you said some books and put out all of the investment and say, yo, we are try, if we try and fail, at least we try. You see me? So, you get a big sum after a couple try. Mm -hmm. You get a big sum. See? And the artist now, you make sure the artist get him publishing and everything. 50%. Because the artist entitled 50% if he write the song. Okay. I'm entitled for 50%. If he write the song. If he write the song. If he not write the song, he not get nothing. Mm -hmm. You just sing the song. So if the song boss go do the dub, go do the show. Mm -hmm. The songwriter need money too. Mm -hmm. The money write the song. So the producer not always be the person who build the rhythm. In. You see me? Some producer buy the rhythm. So if they have a negotiation with the composer and say, oh, here we go on. Take 25 and, and the composer have to tell him to take 25 or mm -hmm. you take none. The mm -hmm. composer have the right to say that. Mm -hmm. And the songwriter have the right to say if the artist to get, if he is not the writer. You see me? Mm -hmm. The producer have the master's part now, where they distribute the song and get the sales and the thing. Mm -hmm. The producers know, if me buy the rhythm from you, I'm going to get no publishing for the rhythm. I have to make money. Otherwise, it's got different, different sector in and different, different section. Or forget you call it a split sheet. Split. You see me? Mm. You have the publishing side. And you also have the, the digital sales side and the master side. But the thing themselves, because I sell a sell a product, you know, like you don't get a water bottle, you put on one label on it. Yeah. Pretty it up. Sell it. Because if you never have one, that probably not sell good. You see me? Because other people look presentable. So you have to pick up a product and sell it so that it is production. So when you do all of that now, Zin, and the artist do him dub them and everything, do him show, he doesn't know if he money gone. And I go link you and say, oh, that song that get all your views, I'll go for my money. <laughs> Why are you respond? <laughs> Why are you respond? <laughs> you, you, you really want me to answer that? <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, I already know I'm gonna sell you yeah, yeah. 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 Really want me yeah, no, why your response? That'll be your response, Noel. Mm. Tell the people. Would you really want me to respond to that after mm. him get fame dub them out of this song yeah, and the fame money dub? Remember, I know him take them dub here yeah, and fold it. All of them fold it and put it in the right pocket. <laughs> <laughs> in the right pocket. All of them fold up this dub money and put it in the right pocket. And the same pocket, them give a man go buy with you. Not knowing, say, yo, me need to put all the money if you're ready there. Big man, it's better you go look at work. <laughs> you remember, you remember <laughs> <to> <laughs> go and look at work because it's not so this thing go. I understand. 
And so it go. So because your money done. But when the fans them come out and say, Yeah, you're the artist, it's true. Because the artists get views. <laughs> Oh, that's and that's oh, ignorance, brother. Is is ignorance and, 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 and me, Noel one time can tell uno this are uh, ignorance. It's because they don't know about the business of music and let me talk about earlier. And the business of music, them don't understand the business of music. Because oh you reach in a master and really, a split is done yeah. when the song in the interim, meaning the song from the song before, before the song will work on you, you, you do a split yeah you say if i if i two producers jointly doing it you say all right then this man here um church um chop city i get 50 percent of the master one time music i get 50 percent of the master and we, we work out the split for the, the songwriter work out the split for the the composer which is the man who made the rhythm i will send it to the distributor and Song release where where you come from now you talk about a song with six million views. <laughs> you want your share? Where where your percentage there? So legally them not, legally them not have no right to claim to that. These young men and young women need to go and learn the business of music. Sure. And stop making an ass of yourself. Because one, you sound stupid. It's like your 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 um you're going to the the, the, the the world of selling TV and you don't know nothing about TV. You just sell this TV. You don't know nothing about it. Mm -hmm. And a man, when they're in the game a long time, you know how for the components of a TV. Then. So he, he, got, he can't do anything with you. And then guess what? So, so, so producers, producers can I rob artists then, right? Can I rob them? Yeah. Oh, oh producers can rob, rob the artists. No, because I, mean, I always hear it said. So your producers always rob artists. Mm -hmm. That's why they take advantage of the artists. Them to them don't know the business. Oh, hold on. You have some producers, they will rob the artists as it relates with them, them publishing. That's the only way I see, see a can rob an artist. Mm -hmm. Is in, if they write the song, you have some producers put for them name as a writer and the composer. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the only way you yeah. can rob the artist. But you have some artists don't even know how to check. <laughs> <laughs> they don't, don't even know how to go and check to see them. them don't know where to go and check to see um if my name is the songwriter on this song. Mm -hmm. So I can get my, my person. Even if you don't sign up with a BMI, you can still go and see a name. Alright. And it's there. Alright, for instance, alright, cool. The brain is not that equipped. And everybody remember password. So if you have a BMI account and don't remember your password, you can't log in. You still can go on the site and type your name and see the it's song gonna register. Come up. It's going to come up. It's going to come up. So it's not like say you have to log in for see. You don't even have to log in. You, under it's every nice. song, it's going to show you who produced a track. It will show you the songwriter. Mm -hmm. It is going to show if there's a composer attached to the split, it will show all of that. You show them things. Man. It's going to show it. So it even, if, if, even if you, the artist, don't claim none of your publishing, it's there. Once the pub, once the producer put your name there for as a songwriter, if it's you write the song, if I you write the song, you put a name there, say a name John Tom, if you do. All the, all the publishing money go. All the publishing money go. All that, all that take. All that, all that do. You, you publish it. Cardema, Cardema say, but the artist not gonna see that. What do you mean the artist not gonna see that? No, that that me answer. Oh, it really good. No man, the same money. thing. The publishing money, same thing. That is is. Remember, publishing is really that 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 is like the radio ear mm -hmm. and all of that. So, I recommend artists and producers not look for your publishing yet. That that that's retirement money. Yeah. You get me? So all this, all the years where you had the music, you saw them play on radio. That money is 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 there and it's 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 being placed down. And yeah. It, most time it paying a pound. If my, if if mm -hmm. remember, so okay. pound, yeah, pound. GVD. So my next GVD. question. No, mm -hmm. is for Terod and Kano. What are you saying? We are wrap up the interview, but you know it wouldn't be a Terod and interview if there wasn't some controversy <laughs> attached to it, because the people them want know, Uno want know, and me want know. I'm sure nobody else on the coach and want know. So Terod, you know, it, there's this big thing happening right now on social media. A lot of people are speculating, and of course, the best way to Clear all speculations, clear all rumors is to hear it from the horse's mouth himself. So, I want to know what's the deal happening. From the Ufa mouth? The RSC, she said. 
Horses. Horses. Oh, oh, oh. You have to pronounce the H right to that. <laughs> <laughs> Tara, what's the deal between you and Silk Boss? Silk Boss is just a great talent. But I really know uh, you know, talk about him. All right. That is it. That is that is that is it. That is all I'm gonna say. So, viewers that are watching, I know I learned learned a lot tonight because I certainly didn't know half of this. So one of the things say, okay, you know what? When I saw the artist them and on a you know the fast life and the girl and the whatever, it's a lot that goes behind of it. And there's so many there's so many careers attached to music that I didn't know about. You know, you can be an engineer and you can be a writer you can be a videographer so when you tell your parents that okay i'm, I'm going to quit music vix, no? or what it, or, or i'm going to go into dance hall like a, a lot of persons just think of oh you want to be an artist you know mm. so i'm very grateful that we got the opportunity to be educated tonight by two of the best in my opinion i mean that and my it. opinion is very yeah, valid no. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> It was very informative. Noel, thank you so much for sitting down and chatting with us. Uh, Tero, of course, I mean, great talent. You're going to go far. And we know that. Me know that the people in my watch know that. That is it. I know. So, oh. thank you guys for tuning in. And I hope you guys learned something. You can drop um, in the comments your thoughts and questions and views. And, you know, if we have the chance, we can always do a follow-up series and, you know, get more in-depth with it. Just leave reviews and let us know how it how it is that you guys um, feed off of it. And of course, follow me on Instagram at Adalia underscore XO and keep up with me. One time, you know, that is it. Boom.